Good morning, friends, and welcome to Thursday, February 11th. Bev Long will start us with Softly and Tenderly. Thursday devotion is found in the Upper Room Discipline, written by Beth Richardson. And our scripture this morning is Psalm 50, 1-2. The Mighty One, God the Lord, who speaks and summons the earth from the rising of the sun to its setting, out of Zion, the perfection of beauty, God shines forth. The Word of God for the people of God. Thanks be to God. The opening verses of this psalm paint a picture of God calling us to from the rising of the sun to its setting. This transforming God yearns for us to notice that God walks before us, behind us, and beside us. A few years ago, the author began to learn more about her Celtic heritage and its spirituality. She learned that her Celtic ancestors lived close to the earth and its rhythms. The old ones invoked blessings of the Holy One from the dawning of the day to its close. No activity was too small or mundane to be blessed by the Creator. God's blessing was asked for the kindling of the fire in the morning and for the smoring of the coals at night. There were blessings for the workers and the children and the livestock, blessings for the beginning of a journey and the safe arrival of travelers. The tools of life were brought before God in gratitude, the loom and the boat, the seeds for planting and the scythe for reaping. All these things were transformed by prayer into connections with the one who created us and gave us life. As she studied and reclaimed her own Celtic heritage, she began to notice more things around her. Through these prayers, her heart of fear and obsession or boredom was transformed into a heart of gratitude. She has added a blessing prayer practice to her day in the form of bless to me prayer. She encourages you to try this practice today. First, think of something or someone you are grateful for, and then remind yourself of how this person or object brings you joy of gratitude. Finally, write about these things using the form, bless to me. Let us pray. Bless to me this quiet time, a meeting of hearts and minds and in book today. Bless to me all those who read these words or hear these words. Happy or sad, troubled or joyful, may they know God's peace. Bless to me this quiet time. Amen. And our closing hymn is Holy, 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 Lord God Almighty, verse 1.
us to me this day. 